What's up, folks? My name is Mike, and if you don't know, in the next around decade, they're going to try to put people on Mars on a one-way trip there so they can live there forever. And uh, I read about this a, a while ago, and I really got to thinking. It, it was such a cool concept that in my lifetime, <clears throat> people could no longer live on planet Earth but still be alive, you know? That's such a cool concept to me. And so when I really started to get down to it, since I am fascinated with the concept of space, like I've mentioned, uh, it's... I started thinking about all these cool things that could that could arise from from living on Mars. For example, one day I would just be browsing YouTube, you know, checking comments, uploading a video or not, whatnot, and then I click on the home page and what do I see? Hey, from Mars, a, a 30 second video of someone saying, "Hey, what's up? My name is Jason or whatever, and I live on Mars." And here's just a panoramic shot of my of my view from Mars. That would be so cool. Like if that's if they establish internet and all that stuff. I'm just saying. But I mean, th how cool would that be if? If, if you just wake up one morning and there's a video, people are co consistently posting videos from Mars. That's crazy. But the one thing I don't really know is what would those people on Mars do? Like, I didn't really read anything about that. So I don't know if they would just be there as the guinea pigs to see if people can actually live on Mars or if they'd be kind of like explorers to see if people like see what there is to do like i don't know they wouldn't really have a they wouldn't really have a job but i think it as cool as it would be it would be pretty boring at first cuz i mean there's nothing to do it's a planet that's pretty barren it looks like a desert and so well, i mean i don't know that, that that's that's interesting to think about but the one the one the one thing that absolutely blows my mind when i think about it's that one day there could be a child born on mars and this child would be the first ever human being to have no idea what it feels like to live on Earth. They would have, despite the fact that they have billions and billions of hours of footage from Earth and the people on Earth, unless, they, like, unless there was a way to travel back and forth, they would never have any idea what it would be like on Earth. And that's, and that's interesting because I think, well, what would they be any different like physically because they don't breathe necessarily earth air they don't drink earth water maybe they maybe they would maybe be like a transport system i don't know but then like if if, the, if there was school what would they what would they learn about would it be I, I would assume it's still pretty much the same stuff they learn on earth but a little bit more relevant to mars but would they learn the geography of earth i mean the history of well i guess the history would be kind of important but i mean it's just it's just really weird that one day whether or not it's in my lifetime there will be if all this pans out and works out great there will be a child children born on mars and there will be two planets that sus that can sustain human life one of which both of which have no idea how the other one is like for the most part and then i was talking about this at work with one of my friends and he came up with this with this scenario where uh, on Mars, they, they somehow find this amazing sustainable resource that can take out, that can replace oil or something like that. And he was saying, well, what, what would happen if, like, would Earth and Mars go to war? And we pretty much dismissed the idea because we figured there'd be some sort of peace treaty. There'd be, I don't know, there would be, like, people, it'd be, I would assume Mars and Earth would be working together at all times. But just the thought, just, just think about that. Just let's say, let perchance... Something someone snaps and they they go they go crazy mode on all of us and it's it's Mars versus Earth for for a resource. I Earth I would assume would win because I mean we we make the technology. Maybe Mars would have new technology. I don't know, but I mean we have so many more people and stuff. But that would be so crazy to, that there would be a war. I think let's just think about it. just think about that. The there the possibility of a war between not countries, not one country for a civil war just planets two planets at war that's crazy that's crazy to think uh would i go to mars absolutely only if i could come back though i don't know if i want to live on mars uh, i would definitely go visit though I, I would love to go visit any planet but thanks for my thanks for watching um go technology and science for letting us visit mars and live on mars thanks for watching love your faces and have an amazing day oh yeah and i uh, died right after i got out of this helicopter so i just edited that out Anyway, see ya!